Jib fest, jib fest, jib fest, jib fest. I'm waking up to ash and dust. I wipe my brow and I sweat in my rust. Newfoundland and Labrador's festivals and events, like the George Street Festival, attract people from all over Canada. The same can be said for the Jib Fest Weekender. Jib Fest is a three-day snowboard and music festival that happens in Cornerbrook, Newfoundland, every year mid-February. Are you ready? This event would have hit its 11-year mark in February, but was cancelled due to the COVID-19 pandemic, like most things during this time. Unfortunately, we did have to cancel it this year. We had a very scaled-down version we were doing this year, working with the bars under the normal operations. Everything's at 50% capacity. Uh, then with the timing of it, we, we did unfortunately have to cancel it. But uh, looking forward to 2021, I mean, you know, we got a great team right now with uh, Chief Medical Officer and everything. Just they're doing an incredible job. We're just following their guidance. Brent McNamara graduated from Memorial University with a Bachelor of Commerce degree. Brent has always had a passion for entrepreneurship and is always thinking of creative new ventures he can pursue. I'm actually, my last work term, we, I started a music festival myself. Um, so that was kind of cool, get to get some experience. And it, it sort of gone full circle in a way because now I hire a lot of students from the business department. So we have a student on right now working with us that was helping us plan GIF Fest and our other events. So it's been cool to be able to get back to the university and, and feed off them and get some of that young energy helping our business grow. So it, it's been a really cool full cycle, yeah. Carter Snow graduated from Academy Canada with a degree in music and recording arts. Brent and Carter have been working together for several years now. Between us, like like he said, he came back from Coachella and he, you know, kind of hit me and a few of the boys up and it's like, how can we do this and this? And then when it comes to production and things like that, like I'm a big nerd. So it's just like <laughs> Brent, Brent gives me a challenge and we're trying to kind of make that happen every year then, you know, and like he said, just bringing those ideas from California and all around the world to try to bring it here so Newfoundlanders don't have to leave to go experience those things, you know? The pair hosts several different events throughout the year, including the hugely popular Jib Fest Weekender, normally held in February at Marble Mountain Ski Resort. While the event has attracted thousands of revelers over the years, the Jib Fest Weekender has pumped millions into the local economy. Kind of just absentmindedly just looked up Marble Mountain and all the rates and kind of made that first call and went out, had a snowboard competition, had a party and had a good time. And now here we are 11 years later, chatting about it on NTV. The event is so popular that the Jib Fest Weekender was nominated for the 2021 Event of the Year at the East Coast Music Awards that is being held in early May. Brent Mac Events produces the Best Kind Comedy Tour, featuring some of Newfoundland and Labrador's top comedians like Brian Alward, Mike Lynch, and Colin Hollett. And then there's the Best Kind Barbecue, which showcases our province's musical and culinary talents. From backyards, to boats, to beaches, and even the rooftop of St. John's City Hall. The event has found a permanent home in Mount Pearl. Best Kind Barbecue is a full day, 12 hour culinary and music event. All types of food, all types of music. So it's really diverse. We have a lot of great events in our, in our, in our province, but we felt something was missing. We, we can't wait to bring it back. You know, we're already working on next year. And I think, you know, it's been a long time. People have been in their house for a long time. People, people want it, I think. So. Hoping to expand our audience a little more every, every year as well. It's amazing what young people can achieve when they put their heart and soul into it. Brent and Carter did exactly that. And that is why the Jib Fest Weekender is Atlantic Canada's premier winter event. For the NTV Sunday Evening News Hour, I'm Becky Daly, and this is Our Time.